stove is a stove, no matter where you go. A patty is a patty. Hello everyone, my name is Finn Fontaine. Today, we're doing another Omegle video. Honestly, I just got an Omegle for fun just now, but I decided, uh, hey, why not? Lately, I've been doing, like, three magic tricks that I remember from when I was little, for fun. Um, I don't know why, and they're honestly not that great, but they do fool a lot of people. But you, you'll probably be able to figure out how I'm doing these uh, when you watch the video, but believe it or not, most people fall for them, so, um, I used to know a lot more and be a lot better at this, but I don't remember very much lately, so, just going off of old tricks that I remember. Anyways, oh man, how you doing? <laughs> Today on Disney Channel, and you draw the fucking, the, the Disney icon in the corner, dude. I wish they had you on there. They don't do that anymore, though. They don't draw the icon anymore. You have a good day. <laughs> All right, good chat. Smile. Make him leave my zone. No, 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 no. Mary never saw us. My Mary never saw us. That's all I hear. Hey, man. What? Yeah. Okay. Fuck you too. Hey, I, dude. I didn't want to talk to you anyway, you ugly bitch. Hey, how you doing? I'm good, man. I'm good too. Uh, I'm with, I'm with you, man. Some some uh piece of shit that I with no lights was like, "What are you doing, fat asshole?" <laughs> I was like, "All right, cool. All right, I'll, all right, turn the light on and tell me I'm fat again, you little bitch. I'll fucking destroy you." <laughs> Dude, there's a lot of assholes on here. <laughs> yeah, no, I just got back from Afghanistan. I'm a fucking marine. Oh, really? That's cool. I was like, man. "Bro, call me fat again, you little bitch. I'll beat the shit out of you." <laughs> I like your attitude. I like you sure, bro. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah. Any maiden Metallica... Well, old Metallica. Yeah. I was just at a... Uh, Megadeth Slayer. Me um, I was at a Megadeth cool concert that um, not that long ago at uh, the Electric Factory in Philadelphia. I'm probably twice your age. <laughs> in 1994, I saw Metallica, Megadeth, and Guns N' Roses at the same fucking show. That's awesome. Yeah, it was Monsters of Rock in yeah, D.C. Uh, at Megadeth, there was also, uh, Suicidal Tendencies, and I forget the name of the other two, but the two other bands, they were smaller, but it's a pretty good concert. It's pretty cool. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, well, you have a good one, man. Alright, yeah, good luck, man. You too. Yeah. Thank you. That guy was a good man. I recognize you. I rec- didn't you da didn't we dance together? Weren't we, weren't we doing something? Do I think I recognize you, right? Don't I recognize you? I'm pretty sure I do. Pretty sure I recognize you. Were you on here yesterday? I think we ran into each other. I'm pretty sure we did. That guy doesn't talk very much. Wow, your boobs are very large. How are you doing? Ooh. Uh, I don't know what I'm looking at. Is that a snake? All right. Oh. Yeah. Oh. I wonder what series of events led up to that. Like, when did he get a program and then put that picture there and be like, yep, this is good. That's a good picture for me. Hey man, how you doing? Hi, I'm doing good. How are you doing? I'm 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 doing pretty good, man. I'm just just chilling, you know. What's Something. your YouTube channel? Ah, you figured out I have a YouTube channel pretty quick. <laughs> uh, my YouTube channel is uh, Finn Fonte, man. The shittiest shittiest channel ever. Do you have a YouTube channel too? I do. But you do. I bet that I bet mine's is even shittier. My, I'm a uh, gaming YouTuber, or That's... like kind of like starting out to be. I uh, I I'm like. I'm all over the place, but I've been doing a lot of gaming lately, too, actually. I actually do voice impressions and beatboxing. You do voice impressions? Yeah. I do voice impressions, too. <laughs> I don't... Do yours. I haven't, I haven't done a lot on my channel, but I'm planning to do more, but, uh... I don't know. I don't know what voices I can do off the top of my head. I have other people sleeping in the house, so I can't be too loud, but I, I know one, I guess. But you have ten subscribers right. now. Thank you. <sighs> Alright, this is a video I actually made, and the video version will be better than this, because I haven't practiced this in a long time, but... Alright, and this song... 
This song has helped me through some dark times. Helps me a lot through life, you know. It's a, it's a real emotional piece. It's a duet, actually. So I'll be performing both both parts. And uh, without further ado, this song is called "Without You," a duet performed by SpongeBob and Mr. Krabs. <laughs> <laughs> so now, <laughs> I'm telling you, I haven't done this in very long, so if you look at my channel, uh, the video of it would probably be better, but <clears throat> let me see if I can get it back. A stove is a stove, no matter where you go. A patty is a patty, that's, <laughs> that's <laughs> what I say. A grill is a grill, this is surely so. And fries to be fried. Fuck, I'm fucking that up all so bad. My voice is so sore. And fries should be fries either way. But this grill is not a home. This is not the stove I know. I would trade it all away if you'd come back to stay. This kitchen's not the same without you. It's just a greasy spoon. Just a greasy spoon. With, <laughs> without you. Okay, that. <laughs> that, was, but, that was beautiful. <laughs> thank you. But um, I can normally do a lot better than that. But I, my voice has been really worn out lately. Here, if I send you, I uploaded a better version of this, which is also kind of rushed because I was I was trying to get it up before I turned. Uh, I was trying to get up while I was still 16, because it was more impressive to do it when I was 16 than when I'm 17. I'm 17 now, mm -hmm. by the way. Um, that's, that's right. yeah. But, um, so I was trying to rush it before my birthday, and, uh, where is this fucking video? Yeah, if you watch that, that'll probably be a little better. Uh, I'm sorry, man, I don't know what happened, but I think you're, I think you're frozen, so, uh, but I do have your YouTube, and I'm still gonna be on here for a little while tonight, so we might actually reconnect, because a lot of times you do that with... People with the same interest, but, um, I'll shoot you, I'll, I'll leave you a comment on, on YouTube. I don't even know if you can hear me, but, sorry I might not be the, uh, most up, up, uppity out there right now, guys, but, I don't know, that sounded weird, but, uh, I just, I have people sleeping, and I wasn't even planning on recording a video, but I, I figured, hey, why not, if I'm getting on for fun. How are you doing? How are you doing? Good. That's good. I'm glad to hear it. Are you an actual YouTuber? I'm the I'm the most I'm the famous the most YouTuber famous. there is, big biggest one right right here. Biggest one right here. Oh, Jake I, I didn't say that. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. The biggest. I got so many fucking yeah, so, so much many fame. Fucking, I don't even have to do so with it. Fame, you know. No. To Molly's foot. We're having a There's three boys over and two girls. Okay. Dad. Oh, you just get the most famous YouTuber ever, bitch. F fine. Oh, hey. How are you? <laughs> How are you doing? Oh, hello there. How are you? Um, not a lot of good characters on tonight, are there? Hello, how are you? Great. How are you? Doing fine. Do you want to see a magic trick? Okay. Alright, man. So, what I got here is a regular deck of rick and morty cards you know what rick and morty is all right my sister bought me these rick and morty edition cards i've been using them now uh keep in mind i'm not an actual magician i've just been fucking around and uh remembering some old tricks that i knew when i was younger so what i'm going to show you here i'm just going to show you this deck of cards so you know that these are real cards no tricks involved you see you dig all right now since again i'm not a real magician and i kind of suck ass I'm gonna just sloppily drop, drop these all over the fucking place and hope that's a good enough shuffle. Well, they fell on the fucking table and shit. It's just. <laughs> just hope that's a good enough shuffle, man, because I don't have any good way to do this. So, whenever you feel that we're pretty well shuffled up, just let me know and we can continue. You're amazing at shuffling. Thank you. I fucking, uh. I am. I should win. <laughs> I should win an award for it, man. You think we're good? Okay. So now, now that we're all mixed up, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this deck, right? And I'm going to put this behind my back. So now that you see, that hand is behind my back and this hand is up here. So there's no way for me to look at the deck and there's no way for me to touch the deck while we're talking. Now see, the first problem on Omegle is that I can't spread the cards out to you and ask you to select one. The only way to do that is for me to select it, but then I can't select it because that's cheating, right? Because I can't really know what card you choose. So basically, 
I have to choose the card, but you have to choose it through me without me actually selecting it. And uh, we're going to do that a pretty magical way. You ready? Alright. So, first off, there are four suits in a deck. There are diamonds, spades, clubs, and hearts. What I want you to do is choose two suits and tell me them. Diamonds and hearts, you said? Okay, out of diamonds and hearts, choose one. Hearts, so that eliminates hearts, leaving diamonds. So now that you have diamonds, we have all of our numbers, and then we have king, queen, jack, and ace. So we have numbers 2 to 10, king, queen, jack, and ace. Out of all of the numbers, and out of king, queen, jack, or ace, I want you to choose 5 of these. So for example, you could choose 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. You could choose 7, 8, 9, king, and ace. You can choose 5 of them and tell me them. 8, 7, 10, jack, king. You said 8, 7, What'd you say? I'm sorry. Three, seven, ten, jack, king. So that eliminates three, seven, ten, jack, king, leaving us with two, four, five, six, nine, um, uh, and queen. And I believe that's all we have left. So out of your remaining options, I want you to choose three. Oh, you also have you also have eight. I forgot. <laughs> 6, 9, and queen. So that eliminates 6, 9, and queen, leaving 2, 4, 5, and 8. So out of 2, 4, 5, and 8, I want you to choose 2. Alright, choose 2 of those for me. 5 and 8, okay. Now out of 5 and 8, choose 1. 5, okay. So now you have 5, and earlier you had diamonds. So you want the 5 of... Diamonds, correct? Okay, how many cards do you want me to pull out before I pull out the five of diamonds? Now you've seen, I haven't looked at the deck and I haven't touched the deck. So how many cards should I pull out before I pull out the five of diamonds? Four? Four, okay. Alright, so here I have my deck, right? Okay. We have one. We have two. We have three. Now... That's the fourth card, so you're saying the card after this should be the five of diamonds, correct? Alright, you ready? You ready for the big reveal? Was that your card? Oh, that's the five of spades. Uh, see, that's a, that's a close one. That's, uh... Oh, and I'm out of chocolate. That's... Oh, what's this? Oh, that... That explains it. That's where I left your card, man. I'm sorry about that. That's where the five of diamonds was. <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking crazy. <laughs> yes, I, I'm a magician. I'll be here all week. I'll be here all week, ladies. Oh, actually, I can take this out now, I guess. I'll be here all week, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> a magician never reveals his tricks. <laughs> we like doing types of tricks where you like move your hands in certain ways, distract me, like, because like, I don't fucking get that. I use, I just use real magic, man. Just real magic in action. <laughs> it was real magic, man. What are you talking about? <laughs> Would you like to see another trick? Okay. So what I have here is the same deck of Rick and Morty cards. Now, this trick um, is much shorter and much more simple, uh, but it... It's harder to do an Amigo because I have to spread out the cards and show you without me seeing what card you select. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start drawing cards off. And whenever you see the card that you want, just let me know and I'll stop. I'm going to, because I'm going to look this way so I can't see as I draw. You know what I mean? Seven. Stop right there. And I have that card. I'm going to put these cards back. I'm going to put that card like that so I can't see it and so the, I can't see it through the camera. So now what we're going to do is take the same deck of cards that I had here, right? We're going to take your card. I'm going to put that right into my deck of cards, into the center, right? So now what it's got to do is go around and squeeze the end drill tight. Make sure that uh, there's no way that card could be sticking out. And once you feel pretty confident that uh, I can't have left the card sticking out, just let me know. Yeah. Feel pretty good about it? All right, all right. So now I just gotta do one main earth, or minor thing, rather, not mainer, <laughs> is, uh, alright, there we go. So what I just did, I just went through the deck real quick, man, and I had to figure out which card was yours using only psychic ability. I channeled, channeled my psychic ability. Now, you ready for this? We're gonna start going through these cards, and we're gonna see if we can find yours, alright? So, 
Okay, no, I don't think it's that one. I don't think it's... I don't... F oh, wait, what's... Oh, that's weird, huh? That's a that's a weird card to be facing the other way. I didn't know you had the King of Diamonds. Not as good as the first one, though. <laughs> Not as good as the first one, yeah, but like I said, that one was more simple. Your headset cord looks so annoying. So, <laughs> it looks so annoying? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It, it is kind of annoying. I had to get used to it beating the shit out of me all day long when I first got it. <laughs> all right. You have a, you have a fantastic day. If you watch my, uh, if you watch my channel, that's what I say at the end of all my videos. Have a fantastic day. Yeah. Because yeah, you get it. <laughs> all right. See you, man. Have a good one. Well, guys, that's all we have for today. So if you enjoyed the Meagle video, feel free to like, subscribe, and comment. And if you do, as I always say, I have absolutely no life, so I will answer because I love hearing feedback. Um, and, uh, yeah, that was, uh, Amigle number... So this is the eighth Amigle video already, wow. Okay, well, thank you guys for watching, and as always, I hope to see you watching the next video. And as always, <laughs> repeated times two, uh, have a fantastic day. That was awful. And repeated times two would actually mean I said it three times, because I said it once and then repeated it twice. Alright, well, fuck all you niggas. What? Hey! What the heck? Where are my Yeah, where are my books moving? Where are my books moving?